So in this extract, we're trying to find the coefficients of the signs for this sawtooth waveform. So the coefficient of the signs, that's the bn terms. These bn's we can compute using this Fourier series uh, formula. But what we need is x of t. And we don't have x of t. All we have is a sketch of x of t. So we need to be able to somehow derive the sketch from that. So we can see that x of t is actually a straight line. And the straight line has a zero intercept, an x intercept, a, a y intercept of zero. So we can probably just say x of t equals t. And here we would need the gradient because the general equation of a straight line is y equals mx plus c. So what we need is the m, the gradient. So to find the gradient, we would look at the rise divided by that. So looking at this sketch here, we have an amplitude here of a, and here we have t over 2. So the gradient is a divided by t over 2. So 2a over t. So that's the equation of the straight line. So if you were to substitute instead of t, if you were to substitute t over 2 in there, you should get that value there of a. So that's where that comes from, and that is how we replace x of t with the equivalent expression. And 2a and t, these are all constants. They can be taken outside of the integration, and we end up with that. And to answer that, you would need integration by parts. Or you could use an integration table. So integration by parts will take you two minutes. Using an integral table will take you one minute to find the table and maybe 30 seconds to, uh, to find the answer. So it's really not much of a saving. So that's, that's how you would um, find the BN terms. Um, so the question really was, how do we find X of T? And we do that by realizing it's a straight line with a zero y-intercept, therefore we'd need the gradient of that straight line.